and number 30 in the black and gold of Appalachian State. He showed his team a graphic this week. Non-conference game against one another back in Southern Miss's Conference USA days back off to the Black Miss Golden Eagles. Rambo Willis is himself he needed to get out of his own way. That was in his words. Billy Wiles at quarterback completes the first pass of the football. And the personnel around him look for him to have a big day today. Seven touchdowns, five interceptions on the season as Frankie Gore Jr. stretches where it all comes out. Snap and will carry the football across the 45, still chugging forward and has a Southern of 13 on the day. 7%. Well, and, and again, they're being productive. Uh, and, you know, and, and you were talking about Frank. Career pass attempts coming out of the running back actually goes into the shotgun and up and down the sideline inside the 20-yard line. It's about 30 yards a game on the season. Wiles looking for the corner. Got a man in single coverage. One-handed. Later responsibilities could not start any better for Southern Miss. PAT is good here at the Rock. I tell you what, that's going to open up some lanes for Frank. Connor Gibbs with the kickoff. Alon Tucker, one of the speedsters in the return game. Now. Premier running back, back into the mix. Second down, a bobble and received catch. It's 41 and a half percent for the year. The version as Horn catches that with a little room to run up to the 45 yard line. Southern Miss defense. First down to 10, App State ball near midfield. Noel not finding the easy running room. Overall. You know, it's hard to win when you have eight guys out on defense, but again, they've got a, 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 a full. Nate Noel being out. Third down and seven. Aguilar with plenty of time. Looking for the pass to Horn. Inside his own 35 yard line. Not too far away from Halloween. Caught at the 13 yard line at Southern Miss. Yard pickup for Southern Miss as they creep toward their 20. A handoff goes to Gore. Shakes a couple of tacklers. Maybe another subtle change for the Golden Eagles as they look to revamp their offense. Long pass down the far side line. earlier today, and he said, Hey, you know, sometimes with replays, you got to show your work. I, I, we didn't see the work there, right? So, but the flag was called. So that's bothering App State, keeping them uh, from being able to replace players, especially along the front. As you see, the State fans, I know, because Levi Lewis carved up the Mountaineers a time or two, especially late in his career. Another carry straight up on second and 21, brings up third down and 11. Wiles off his back foot, overthrows that pass. Southern Miss with 107 yards of total offense. They barely clipped, and they've downed App State inside the fifth. He, he knows that he's he's four or five plays away from you know winning a you know, few more football games. So he's got confidence. And we said, DJ, this is the year against Gardner Webb right here at the Rock. Kind of an excuse me pass out to Makai Jackson, Dan App State, from their own 44. horizontal passing game so that those linebackers and safeties can stop focusing so much on the run. Aguilar as App State goes over there for opportunity sailing out of bounds. We'll watch the walk up here. They not only switched off the coordinators, they switched the quarterback last week trying to get a spark. Looks like the spark has worked at field along with Billy Wiles. Wiles with some pressure for the first time and that ball is not picked off. NFL Network broadcast. Third down and 10. Wiles running for his life again. Heaves that one into the side. Often inside his own from the six on the step. Punts the football away. Fair catch called for maybe a bit. Get some adjustments and now doing a better job of stopping. Mikel Haywood with his first carry of the football game in the positive gain of about six. Good running back just kind of powering through there. Rolling pressure coming. Takes him down. Quite a chase by seven. Aguilar lost about three on the plane. Gets the corner. There he goes. Down the sideline with one man to beat in the close off. Aggressive tackling is what it is. And for Robinson, comes back to the football and catches inside the 10. Two guy, when you need to move the chains, there he is. Hand off. Haywood to pay. Here, late first quarter. And Hughes delivers. And football game for Southern Miss. Possession in their first kickoff return, not now. Golden Eagles got out to a hot start in that App State pressure. Cole Cavello, the tight end in motion. Earl caught by Caston with some room to run. Up the back of his own blocker out across the third. He'll still be running. Kenyon Clay in there as a protection back. Wiles looking to throw that ball batted away and nearly picked off another long side numbers. That is just a long throw. That's Second long down throw. and 10. Wiles running. Thought he might have had a chance to play. 
and kept his eyes downfield and made a nice throw. Six of his first 10 in the passing game, making now seven of his first 11. The offense has. Southern Miss got the playoff before the end of the quarter, or did they? The whistle the blows the after the play. His name is on the basketball arena down in Hattiesburg. So two guys coach a game in the late 30s, and now they are immortalized on the sides. Great, great men do great things, and great things happen for them eventually. Billy Wiles trying to do some great things for this Southern Miss offense, and he... Wiles fakes the handoff. Play action look is good for a catch across the middle to time of the game too. So that might have caught App State by surprise. Great move by Gore as he steps left, cuts back right where he's had 20 or more carries. Play action looking for the corner once again. There's Jones. He likes that pylon. Some of that pressure off Wiles. Here's Billy Wiles on third down and five again. Looking for the corner again and go back to the same spot. Stein from 31. He's five of five. He hits the upright. Make him five. Dodge that Southern Miss field goal quite literally, actually. And Nate Noel will go to work. Makes one man miss across the 25 up to the 20. On the scene. Second down and seven. Kanye Roberts now back in. And Roberts fighting across the. Quicker on that zone play versus, you know, and the time I say that, Kanye busts one for a first down. But Kanye, the hole, he can make a lot of guys miss. Play action to Roberts. And the underneath look for stops this year. Third down and one. Handoff goes to Roberts across the middle, and I don't think he got over 1,200 pounds of man manhood. Roberts had had all of the momentum on that drive, and it just stopped right there on the third down. For the missed field goal by Andrew Stein for a pass play on first down. Great comeback to the football and catch across midfield. Another big over 30 yards on the reception. That's about a 70 yard day now for Jones. As Southern Miss goes for about two weeks, then the Carolina Panthers, sorry, going to take that one. Pass into double coverage, falls in on third and five. Gore read it perfectly inside the tackle, still on his feet, heading to pay dirt. Go Gore makes his first guy miss, and then it's just watching him work, watching him evade tacklers and do what he does. Andrew Stein on the PAT, and he splits it perfectly. Southern Miss back out on top. Doing and see the psyche of the team. I, I knew this would be a close football game. Re-kick after a penalty against Southern Miss. Football game. I think you'd also ask those coaches and say it's about timing sometimes too. Great square in and release. Milan Tucker out deep around 15 to 20 yards and then it's more route by Aguilar by in trouble. He breaks one off himself inside the 30 yard line. Make Already thin, ultra thin secondary for Southern Miss. So Dan O'Brien will get a sense of where Dillon. So it's been difficult for Dan Aguilar on the release once again. Wilson charging to the pylon. Got there. Touch career. And the PAT through the uprights. 14 on Wednesday. So those that are in a season. And we've got a great stage for what should be a whale of a finish here. Three play 70. Sam Gregg and, and, and Jordy Joseph, the co-offensive coordinator, is in good execution by the players. Play trying to run out of an arm tackle, and he is stymied pattern There's and, no flag uh, on the play. maybe maybe they they deemed it second down and about two play just about that same area he tries the stutter step and get in to the home team soup in to the near side gore all the way in oh, again they, they they ran to the strength of the offense to the weakness of the defense and that was a run play because of the person you know the, the line for the love of the game Find a spark so that you can play a little better and play with a little intensity. Kanye Roberts gets drilled out of bounds at the four-yard pickup. Play action. Look, Aguilar passing just before pressure, and he's got a first down gain out on the edge to 70% mark. He was at that same clip against ODU last week. How about Roberts with the spin move there? Pressed B and slides down. Set, resetting that offensive line. Play action to Haywood. Aguilar stepping up. Pressure coming, and he'll just heave the ball toward the Mississippi defenders are pretty big guys. They're tall and big. Third and 18, and Aguilar dropped again. And a flag comes. Not as a quality control coach, but. This catch across the middle, trying to win the foot race to the five. Touchdown. We're really needed by this football team for a spark because they, they came out very, very flat. 57 yard catch for Deshaun Davis. That's just the one catch third touchdown of the year seventh of his career and for Davis who again got off the advantage that was given to them there with good midfield position one play later scored the big touchdown little thing 
looking for an answer to that opening App State score. And he's in open space. They take it over to the house. A drive. Just, just Southern Mississippi taking a good advantage of, of alignment of the secondary. Again, safety. safety. Tremendously today. Well, when they say a savant, you know, lead and when not to lead or when to follow. Think about this. Hall, no. uh, uh, Greg and, and George, that just says a lot about him as a football coach. Catch and release for Milan. Tucker across the third. But thus far in this one, leading by 10 on the road. Throwing into double coverage and overthrows Milan Tucker that time. It'll bring up. Is up by 10 right now. It's because of the selection of decisions they're making. Aguilar dropped for the third time. Pretty much getting pressure with three. That time they did bring a linebacker. Aguilar has got a man overthrew Hetzel. He died, but, but, but he did put a little too much on that one. Punt earlier. This one kind of a sidewinder that's taken by Mina Top. First down at 10. A little bit of room to run. Let's see. He'll throw toward the boundary and sideways with whether that was inbounds or not. Let's see. Great replay. Puts down. Done a great job of not only the, the short horizontal passing game, but the intermediate passing game, which is Rick Kavavitz, who walks off the field. Right through two defenders. He leans forward to the 35. Southern Miss quickly back to work. Wiles looking down on second down. Pittman's first touch, and he is met at the line of script from the 38-yard line. And go off Wiles right. Shotgun snap. Looking in the seam. He's got a man in the end zone. And that ball batted. And, and help out, but we got lucky on that play. App State switching up the running game once again. Pick up from Marshall, the Winston-Salem native. Hits the hole again. Needed to get to the. It's off the ball, but good hard running by, by Marshall. Marshall had only one carry against Old Dominion last week. There's a pass out on the about this offensive drive. Marshall trying to get the corner and the corner came to him. Josh Carr met in the timeout, trying to move the chains once again on this drive. Aguilar bouncing with time. He's got room to run for it. Instead, does some people wondering, hey, this is usually Sean Clark fourth down territory, but instead Lake going to try to pin Southern Miss back. Game going this week, that balance has been nearly perfect. 223 on the ground, 229 in the air as Frank Gore goes to work again. So Gore picks up six more and goes over the 200 mark in the contest. Second down and four. Play action look. Wiles out on the boundary, and that is a Cantoneers wanted to dial that up right now. Cavello the tight end in motion toward the right. Wiles trying to go that way. That ball thrown right off the chip. Play call here. Or maybe not. Wiles trying to go for it, and he's dropped right on the goal line. Though. That's a fumble. Clear as day. Turnover chain has shown up for the first time. They've been toy library-esque rock here today. Off the left side, and he's in. Touchdown, App State. Don't go. Clearing the hole for Amani Marshall for his second rushing touchdown of the year. PAT is good. It's been a tough, tough. You're right. Who, who, who'll take the bull by the horn and say, okay, we're going to finish this game ball team? Here comes Wiles with a little bit more crowd noise in the background this time. Clay trying to shake free. Made the same. And that just shows you how programs, when they're getting ready, especially to take on an opponent that they haven't seen. That's football in the Sun Belt. Can't beat it. Wiles to Gore up the middle, and he's got the first down across the 35. Out in the, in the flat areas on the perimeter. And again, he, he's, uh, he has good vision, good balance, uh, and pass happy offenses these days. Flags fly, play blown dead. Looks like a false start. Potentially here for them and a great football game as well. Wiles with Dingle Prince chasing him. Heaves that one out. Been overly active in the passing game today. He's been in, a, in blocking quite a bit as he walks off. He had a really for back look. And now we have a whistle up front and movement. You know what? I've seen that call more and more. Uh, over the last couple of weeks, it is it's kind of, some of these defenders are not trying to mimic Gore the quarterback for the pass. There, it's lined up. So a lot of times they're clapping to get some guys' attention. Wiles hands off to Gore. A little bit more natural touch of the football. This 17 of 32 in the passing game for two. The middle seat that ball's caught. Mims with a heck of a grab at the 35-yard line. Beat the safeties and behind the linebackers and just 
uh, does a nice job of throwing the football uh, and getting, getting a reception. Down and short. Pressure. Trying to get to the boundary, and he is hit hard. 100-plus yard rushing game. Looking to add to that total right here as he takes it up the middle of the App State defense inside the 20 year best in the passing game. More on that in a moment. Clay takes this ball off the right side, gets the corner. Clay off to his left. Crawford scored one touchdown on the sweep, taking it toward the pylon, and he's in easily. Touchdowns. Methodically, good play by the offensive line. Diversified play calling by the offensive, co-offensive coordinators. Uh, State to 60 yards rushing as Kanye Roberts tries to get things rolling. Carry Appalachian fan is the fact that you, you, you try to plug in all these different running backs and without success, <clears throat> you're not being successful because you're, you're, you know, you're throwing so many guys into the, you know, the running back fold. Um, so I need one here on third down and two. Kanye Roberts on the decoy. It's at that they over pursued and just turned it up. Good Aguilar beating one down the sideline and that ball is batted away in Combrine. Still looking for something that will run himself and at least get two pass midfield again. Aguilar Ford shakes a tackler at the 30. Trying to find his balance to the goal line. Six yards and that touchdown on the day, a 49-yard strike. PAT is good. Ball game, they were only averaging 265. So obviously Ag Aguilar, his arm and his ability. Kick off from Hugh. And will be down for the touchback. Given up, what, almost uh, a little over 400 yards and, and, at 38 points. So really hit or, or is better than what I thought they would be after watching South Alabama take, if I didn't know about the eight players. But but they played, they, they, they're much better.